Hi, I'm Veronica Wasek with the 5MinuteBookkeeping.com blog where we show you how to minimize bookkeeping and maximize profits. When I started my modern accounting business in 2010, I had one goal in mind. I just wanted to be a solopreneur and replace the full-time income that I used to earn before losing two jobs to the Great Recession. Well, little did I know that seven years later, I would have four full-time employees, office space, and the chance to help hundreds of small business clients. I'm going to share with you my story of how I grew my business and five amazing ways that you can grow your business using QuickBooks Online. Number one, streamline and automate. The first thing I did was make my business 100% cloud-based. Next, I converted my company to QuickBooks Online. Then I kicked it up a notch by streamlining and automating my manual business processes with apps like Bill.com for electronic bill payments, Cloud Receipt Storage with Receipt Bank, Simple Payroll with QuickBooks Online Full Service Payroll, or even Gusto, and Electronic Employee Expense Reports with Tally. I've included the links to all of these apps in the box below, so check them out. Number two, create a steady stream of cash. You know that in small business, cash is king. So, so to guarantee a steady stream of cash, I packaged my service offerings by creating service packages. I switched from hourly to fixed pricing and I invoice in advance. Number three, monitor revenue by major income categories. So here's what I did. I formatted my profit and loss report in QuickBooks Online so that I could monitor our income by major revenue categories and by percentage of income. I compared percentages from one year to the next, and then I saw a trend. My outsourced cloud accounting services grew as a percentage of income over a period of three years. This led me to prioritize my time, my marketing dollars and resources to cloud accounting services rather than other services. So just by tracking the numbers, I made the right decision, which led to significant growth in my business. So check out the blog post to see a screenshot of a sample report. I've included the link in the box below. Number four, control your expenses. I review my expenses on my profit and loss, and I compare them month to month, just to make sure that I don't overpay for anything. Again, check out the blog post for a sample report and the story of the surprising expenses that I found that I was overpaying. Number five, measure your success. Every month, my accounting manager and I meet to review key financial management reports. We call this the financial strategy meeting, and it has revolutionized how I run my business. I now have complete clarity about the financial aspects of my company. I know how we're doing and how we're doing against our goal. Every month, we carefully go over our profit and loss report, our balance sheet, and our budget versus actual comparison. We monitor balances and question anything that looks out of place. I have to admit, even though I'm an accountant, the thought of reviewing my reports was intimidating to me at first, but now I feel empowered and in control. Growing a business is not easy. Believe me, I know. It takes commitment, hard work, dedication, and discipline. I hope that my story will inspire you to grow your business and to keep going. So now that I've shared these five amazing ways to grow your business, leave a comment below and let me know about your business journey. And do me a favor, subscribe to my channel and share this video with others. And visit my blog at 5minutebookkeeping.com for more tips on how to minimize your bookkeeping and maximize your profits.